Wow. Wanna give all praises to Yahweh, Bashem, Yahushai, Bashem, Kakodash, you know, double honors to the elders and the pastors of GMS, and salutation to the brothers who's pushing this shoot, the four corners, highways, and byways. You know, um, you know, above the ball to this wicked place, right? Because we, we're living in the time that Yahweh, Bashem, Yahushai is turning up, sort prophecy, right? Turning up the heat in the kitchen. You know, for brothers who fake in it, brothers, you know, who have feeble knees, you know, lift up them hands on feeble knees, unless that which is weary be um, cast out to the way. So this is time, this we living in the time when the heat is on. That's right. You understand? But the, at the same time, we giving our priest how about Shemi or Shai for, for um, endurance. In, endurance, because shall we only receive good of the Mosai and not receive evil? Yes, and Mosai is of balance, and only the men of the Lord can understand it. That's right. But nevertheless, we're going into our um, article today, okay. right? Um, this is Brother Yashamar. Yeah, it's Brother Mashat. Brother Yamsa. And Brother Yaramio. Khan. So, we're basically going through an article. It states, not Guyana alone ex um, experiencing rise in food prices. Okay. By, right? By the FAO. By, yeah, by the FAO, that's um, quoted by the FAO. Hey, it was ridiculous. A mm -hmm. planting, which was, well, I know, but me, I used to get it like, um, say, nine to five dollars or wrong to after a hundred dollars a pong. Mm -hmm. Now it's actually three hundred and sixty right. dollars mm -hmm. a pong. Yeah. You know, even um, the, the chicken and that gone up to four hundred and something dollars a pong. Yeah. You, yeah. you know. The, the, the um the cost of living right now in Guyana, all right, is that the more all right the more the the, the panic the pandemic heats up the more these um businesses um, that import and export are rising the prices, you know. Gone, gone. Yeah, yeah and, uh, this uh, yeah, okay. yeah. this is um Hagai one of our six. Ye have sown much and bring in little. Right? Ye eat, but ye have not enough. Right? So what? The scripture also says, right, rise up from here because this is not the place where we rest. Right? right? What Jacob failed to realize, a lot of them teaching that, hey, we in the kingdom, this is the kingdom, we gotta make the best out of it. Yeah. And every day they see, saying, hey, especially Jake, you work, you're working, you're putting in so much and you getting paid so little. You had so much taxes to pay, right. yeah, but yet still, the, the taxes when you do check it all around, and the things, your bills and all these things you gotta pay, is but 10 times or 100 times the, the, the pay or the salary you get in from your job. That's right. Yeah. Right? Yeah. And these people would not just set the mind on your how about me but they're settling for less. Right. They're settling for this kingdom. That's right. They can't even enjoy a proper yayan. You can't, can't afford it. Yeah. We got precepts for them. Right? Yeah. You got um when I'm with the precept. Read from five, read from like five. Okay. Alright, good. I'm bounce back. This is how I want to voice five. It says, Now therefore thus set your how power. Consider your ways. Yeah, Lord is telling them consider the way because why? Our people, alright, are comfortable in this society. Right. You know, a lot of these people, right? Two thirds of our people are compliant with um, the so called testing. You know, they go out and uh, they want, you know, they have rent to pay, bills to pay, but they don't consider the Lord. They don't consider the prophets being in the highways and byways and giving ears to repentance. You know, they will just pass us and see us and say, you know, these men are there for nothing. These men is bums. But the Lord is telling you that, hey, I'm going to rise the, uh, rise, um, the elect in, in, before the face. Yeah, right. Uh, also, to add to the precept that says wisdom and knowledge shall be the stability of thy time. Right. Yeah, this is your power. I'm advising us to consider we ways. Right. Because you know we living in a time you gotta you gotta be um discreet. So yeah. That's a too. beautiful word. That's a beautiful word. Huh? Right. You gotta be discreet in this time. You can't be living long. Uh, what was the word? Luxurious. Like like yeah, like a basic. You gotta you gotta be spending uh, wisely. Right? Why hey? You know? yeah, there's no time to play with because you 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 easily run in broke within um hours time by the time you collect your pay. Yeah. yeah. 
just because the things you have to look after, you got children like me who got army. <laughs> yeah. You see? You got to do what's necessary. Yeah. Make sure they're covered. Yeah. And even your, your family hey, is, is hard to say, but it, it, it might sound wrong, but you just really got. How, how it is now is like you just got to measure eating. You got to measure the thing that you're using. So, hey, you know, listen, you got to consider your ways. Apart from that, you know, for these wicked two thirds, right? Consider your ways because you, you, you know, depending on this system so much and you're not seeing that so much is required of you when you're getting in return little. Yeah. You're being a fool for the system. Yeah, they're being blinded. For, for this, um, for this beast. Uh -huh. Yeah, because they, when you look at it, the counselors that counsel them, you know, two thirds of Israel, the heads that set up over them. All right, because we have a king. Our king, our king is Yahweh Hashem All right, we don't we don't um, acknowledge the, the governments that they have set up. Can. We know that there is one true power, Can. and that's who we are waiting. But you see, as our people, you know, you know, they listen. Like for example, you know, we were taking a public trans. I was taking a public transportation, and the driver was telling everybody that came in the bus, "Hey, put down your mask, put down your mask, put down your mask." You know, and he himself is coughing to hell. <laughs> <laughs> Tell him protect the self yeah. from me. And he cough into fury and you know he, he already say he take the you know the biscuits and he can't help himself. He said don't care what he do, he not getting rid of the um the cough that he has. Okay. You see? But yet still he telling Jake that they're on the outside, hey put on this put on though, and he's strict with it. You see? Because okay. in a way he don't wanna feel um accountable. If anybody um, get anything from him, yeah. but if he said that he's doing things to get rid of it, then you know. And there's the thing, right? Even in this, even in these precepts, you can bring out in a few, is that these people don't push yourself on the level with wickedness, but in righteousness, they ain't gonna do it. That's right. You know what I'm saying? Yep. Yeah. The weary, the self in in thing, and this video saying the last day for we weary ourselves. Yeah. With wickedness. Yeah. 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 This is Ezekiel 4 mm -hmm. and verse 11. So now we start from 68 to the point of it. It says, um, Moreover, he said unto me, Son of man, behold, I will break the staff of bread in Jerusalem, and they shall eat bread by weight right. and with care, and they shall drink water by measure right. and with astonishment. And this is going on even right now. Because the brother just brought out and also according to the facts shown is that now you got pay for water and then the water that you pay for you didn't even prop up you see long ago you could have go and get the water from the creek you could go and get water anyway but now it is the food that you're buying it going up and the prices ain't dropping back much less they don't pollute them yeah it says um, that verse 17 that they may want bread and water and be astonished or astonished one with another and, and consume away for their iniquity. Even to this knowledge and all too, the torture it too. Mm -hmm. Right? They go into these um, so called Christian um, harlot houses. Mm -hmm. They're paying, but they ain't getting, you understand what I'm saying? They're getting this word. Yeah. They're getting this truth. Right? When the most I said the, the, this word is free. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. Read the article. Huh? And even in the head, in the article, it says not Guyana alone experiencing the rise of food prices. But this is the thing, right? How to say this? Not Guyana alone. It's, it it was Peter pay for Paul and Paul pay for all. It goes back to his, um, his, um, Revelation 18. They all are drinking the wine of a wrath of a fornication. So as the as the rule of the people is, as the ruler, so are the people. Roughly paraphrasing, right? Right. So, and Guyana was supposed to be an independent nation. Why so, is it that that the food prices in Guyana are raising? Because the world currency, which is the U.S. dollar, is is dropping, and it's not that food prices raising. It's that the value of the money is raising. So we gotta get more money for the item because the value of the of the money is dropping. That's right. Right. That's right. So even even so, if you say that this is show wicked, the system is wicked still, mm -hmm. because if there's a rise for certain purchases, an item, 
what about the um the uh, for instance if you're working at any jo institution any job or anything like that well the product that you selling at your job for my saying reason as well the, right. the 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 pain supposed to raise as well oh no no it's the same because away with the work you know the system is that the more they pay you less is the more you're going to be connected to the work yeah. the more you can become dependent on them and that's how they want to have you in the system exactly so the more you become this dependent in the system is the more they're going to be able to enforce the mark <laughs> yeah. yeah you know don't have to multitude that's um that's tired you know anyway yeah this is um the article it says not guyana alone experiencing rise in food prices FAO right see they, they they're showing a piece of the market persons in the city market complying with um, national COVID health measures including wearing face masks and it's like from from Yeah, it's a safe statement. It's a food and agriculture organization, FAO, on the United Nations representative to Guyana, Dr. Gillian Smith, disclosed on, Feb on Friday that not Guyan Guyanese alone are experiencing the rise of food prices but the rest of the world as well in a report published on january 6 by the united nations food and agriculture organization which is fao on the fao food pricing index it was confirmed that the food prices was continuing to rise and not just in guyana so you see they, they have an index um, for, the, for the fact that they have an index, an index would be like a what, catalog of how these prices regulate and so forth. Which means that they got control for all these stuff. They could end world hunger. But it's prophesied by Yahweh Bashim Yoshai that these things must happen because of the wicked, wickedness in the world. Right. The Mosa is not going to reward the wicked because, you know, because you just can or because you know where the whole we know it's scripture said that the most high cause in the rain to fall on the just and the unjust and the sun to shine on the just and the unjust right but the the way the world was designed is to be in accordance with the most high laws statutes and commandments but if the world refused to be out of order then then what would happen the earth and I yield it, its fruits you know what I'm saying yeah, Another reason too is that the earth is supposed to be in um in the Sabbath too. That's right. In order to produce good quality foods. But with these um elite stone of the Edomites, with uh, along with these Eden nations that are joined ears with them, is that they the most I put in the in the spirit for them to do what they, the scripture said they're gonna do. They're gonna be wicked. And in order for for the, uh, for them to set up this um karagma in the four corners of the earth, they have to um diminished certain foods they have to shut down certain companies yeah. in order to focus on the the company that everybody could go to them yeah. remember the scriptures say um call him the uh, son of perdition all right when you go into perdition they talk about being this the son of destruction what by what by money yeah. all right the love of money all right yeah. and this what they're forcing they're forcing it that they could profit all the time so the poor the poor gonna get robbed more. The rich gonna be more richer, and the so-called middle class they gonna wipe them out. Yeah. That's the whole purpose of this thing. Good, huh? Can. It go. It goes on. It says in 2021, FAO food price index continued to trend upwards, reaching a 10-year high, despite a few months which registered small reductions including December in fact the 2021 FAO food price index was just over 28 percent higher than 2020 you see that in, in a 10 in a in a few months a 10-year food price rise 
and that's the most high speeding up times and speeding up judgment but these people ain't waking up these people are still thinking that you know you know it's just for a moment it's just for a time the evil shall not come and so forth but the most high got a, a real dread awakening for these people all right mm -hmm. um Ezekiel 7? Yeah, read from Ezekiel 7. Alright, this is the book of Ezekiel. Chapter 7 and verse 12 it says, And the time is come, the day draweth near. Let not the buyer rejoice, mm -hmm. nor the seller mourn, for wrath is upon all the multitude thereof. Verse 13. So it says, Don't let the seller, don't let the seller rejoice and the don't let the buyer rejoice and the seller mourn. Because the buyer think that he can buy stocks and he can get to push it off because he's investing and so forth. And don't let the seller mourn because he can get in for selling items, you know. Because it is it's because it's a wickedness. Yeah. Which which also going back to also the farmer and the sellers too. Mm -hmm. Because right now in the marketplaces you find that. The, um, the farmers that when they come with these produce, the price is so high that the sellers them, hey, they got to try to sell it at a more higher price. Mm -hmm. Now the consumer, now the man that buying, now he can can't afford to pay though. So what, uh, the, 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 the produce that they have going to perish. Yep, yep. Pestilence going to hit it. Because yep. a lot of these people that got large amount of these, um, like for example, goods, rat on them thing, biting up the thing them too. That's right. Yeah. That? Story too long. Yeah. Verse 13 of Ezekiel 7 For the seller shall not return to that which is sold So the seller can't, can't, um, can't go back and get money mm -hmm. Although they were yet alive mm -hmm. For the vision is touching the whole multitude thereof mm -hmm. Which shall not return Neither shall any strengthen himself in the iniquity of his life So nobody will not be able to build or, or or the business and our rights in, the, in this time. Or this was talking about back then, but the same thing applied because the scripture says in the, um, Ecclesiastes that which have been the most I required again. Right. All right, but yet Jake will not learn. Jake, Jake still ain't seen it because they don't want they don't want this kingdom to end. They want this kingdom to continue. Yeah. Go down, go down some more. Verse fourteen. It says they have blown. They have blown the trumpet. Even to make all ready, but not go into the battle. For my wrath is upon all the multitude thereof. Yeah, and right now in America, they, they, they what are they doing? They're doing um draft. And the women getting drafted in the crying and so forth. Because the most I blow in the trumpet, the most I preparing, mustering the battle. That's right. You read that? Verse 15. The sword mm -hmm. is without, and the pestilence and the famine within. He that is in the field shall die with the sword. Mm -hmm. And he that is in the city, famine and pestilence, shall devour him. Now this, that there is going to be an increase in this around the world. A lot of countries, I think it's in Yemen, got famine right now. Right. And many other countries around the world are going to have a famine. And as it says here, if the pestilence don't kill you inside the arm, uh, the pestilence and the famine don't kill you in the city, the sword can kill you because in the field. Because we really feel referring to them what we call a rural area or them bush area, right? Or them country area. Because they ain't got certain access to certain things and people gonna kill them fit. You know? Go ahead. Up. Verse 6, but they that 16. Verse 16, okay. Mm. But they that escape of them shall escape and shall be on the mountains like doves of the valley, all of them mourning every one for his iniquity. Verse 17, and, and all hands shall be feeble and all knees shall be weak as water. As I was saying, you now it's time to burn up your lines. Now it's not time to be weak. And on the note, when I was saying, it remind me when my grandmother said that she, she tried a dry fast, which is no water, no food, right? For 24 hours. And she nearly, she nearly, well, she nearly <laughs> crank, crank out. This was when she was younger, she said, she's like, since then she never do it. So if a young woman like she, as that mother young woman, if a woman like she would have had better foods than we did, according to these times, can't handle the much as in these in, in these terrible days to come. They had good food but they set it at night for the pork and the shrimp. 
Yep, yep. So you, you know, you now, and I ain't not saying that I know, mm. no, she come up and if she had days where she, she had to eat bread and what, but still, she had something to eat. But when the time come when you got nothing to eat for three days, what gonna happen? You cramp out, you wanna kill yourself, you wanna pull out your hair, your head, you wanna do, you wanna eat your own people, eat your own family, eat all sort of abominable stuff. And there's what the wisdom and stability. Wisdom and knowledge, so like a wisdom and knowledge can be the stability of the time. The wisdom is how you apply the scriptures and the knowledge is the knowledge that you gain from studying and, and, and putting your focus in Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. And what the stability is, is help you stand firm mm -hmm. and not be wavering and, and being blown with every little strong wind that come and push you away. Because we can be like pilgrims upon the earth. We can sleep sleeping in some messed up places. The Apostle Paul said it in, uh, I think it's uh, 1 Corinthians 11. That he was shipwrecked, he suffered hunger, be robbed, and all these different types of persecution, but he still keep teaching the word. You know what I'm saying? But that's just for a time for the men of the Lord. And then the most I said what? Behold, my servant shall eat, behold, my servant shall drink, behold, my servant shall laugh and sing. Right? You got that? Yeah, Continue in Ezekiel. Yeah, going back to uh, Ezekiel 17, 7 and 17. It says, All hands shall be feeble and all knees shall be weak as water. Mm -hmm. Verse 18, they shall also gird, gird themselves with sackcloth, mm -hmm. and horror shall cover them. Mm -hmm. And shame shall be upon all faces, and baldness upon all the heads. Mm -hmm. Verse 19, they shall cast their silver in the street, and their gold shall be removed. All right, now back then it would have been literally silver and gold. Why? Because the money can not buy them. Because people are just looking for basic needs. Right. And the same thing happened in Venezuela. A whole load of money is on the streets of Venezuela because well, he saw sending, sending the um, economic assassin, economic hitman. Right? And yeah, the forcing us so the digital currency over there too. Yeah. And there's the plan because there was like a, a, a way you call a so called experiment for saw to see how best they could well, exploit and, and break down the system, the dollar system. For bringing the cryptocurrency, the digital currency. Yeah. Read that? Yeah, verse, uh, Read up is, 19. Ezekiel 7 and 19. It says, They shall cast their silver in the street, and their gold shall be removed. Mm -hmm. Their silver and their gold shall not be able to deliver them in the day mm -hmm. of the wrath of the Lord. Uh -huh. They shall not satisfy their soul, mm -hmm. neither fill their bowels, uh -huh. because it is the stumbling block of their iniquity. Right, they can't fold the bowels. They can't eat lavishly. You know, people borrowing money just so that they could keep the pagan holiday, Thanksgiving and, and Christmas and all these other holidays. And, and then, there's what coming up next? Valentine's and then Mother's Day and all these other things. People can well, borrow money from people and all sort of things so that they could well, maintain their lifestyle in Babylon, the Babylonian lifestyle. You got it, John. Read back the article, you could tell them. Yeah, okay. It says, uh, The FAO Food Price Index mm -hmm. is a well-recognized tool that takes monthly charges in commonly traded, traded international food com commodities. Mm -hmm. Cereals, including rice, vegetable, oil, sugar, meat, and dairy. Roughly, it indicates it indicates how much country may expect to pay for these types of commodities in global markets, imports, but also what prices countries might expect to receive from their, for their food export, exports. The factories contributing to these rise in the, so like here, the factors contributing to the rise in, in yeah, in individual commodities, prices are numerous and interact in complex ways. According to Zorita... Now they, now they mm -hmm. try to say that these, the, re, the reason for these food prices right, is complex stuff. But like we said, they could solve this stuff easily. But, but they um, but Esau's agenda is to put people or pressure people or for rushing to people like a flood, coming to uh, come out to them like a flood. For make the make the panic and spend on all the resources and so forth so that what they're gonna do they're gonna subject themselves onto the um the karagma the chip 
easily because woody chip can come with certain perks you can get this amount of money if you take the chip you can get this sort of benefit if you get a chip you can get just like gonna use the ebt which is uh forget the uh what the abbreviation mean again but it was um, a system that set up whereby the government would give you certain access to certain um basic needs because of your situation and your lifestyle you got that okay it says here According to the report, according to the report, food production levels supplies, particularly among leading produ producers, are import important. In December 2021, global poultry prices declined somewhat primarily due to the increase of global ex exportable um, supplies. However, also important so they're talking about supplies, right? The reason why these things raise is because these supplies are uh, why these supplies why these supplies are being accessible because of the um, so-called crown royal um, so-called crown royal so-called crown royal um, crown royal um, protocols were set up. A lot of stuff that go through scanning and all these type of stuff and sanit sanitization and so forth. So the cause when the late back in back in last year there was a photo showing around uh, I think it's October or August how a lot of container ships was backed up because of certain protocols that have to carry up. That's that. Okay. However, also important important to price charges are levels of price stock. Changes. So like, yeah. However, also important to price changes are the levels of stocks on how that are in veil um, available to the market on hand that are available to the market on hand that are available to the market yeah. this is often seen with ce um, cereals such as wheat and maize demand also play a role in food prices the, the report stated adding to the seasonal demands for Christmas top <laughs> Temporarily drove the price of some types of meat on global markets. Now we understand around Christmas time the meat is raised because it's a it's a demand, right? Yeah. But they just they just pull in basic stuff out of the out of the um, out of the common stuff and like exaggerating it and finding excuses. But we all know that Isa is controlling all this stuff so that he can carry out the agenda get this digital digital currency as as the go-to way of of, bar of, of um, buying and selling. Continue. Yeah, they even said how it's going to be said how it's going to be hard. The times ahead going to be hard for those who who not um, crowned. Okay. You understand? Take the juice. Yeah, you won't take the juice. Right, because yeah, you won't take the juice for the crown because basically you got to be in the system you know, for all of these so-called hardship and decline and increase of prices for, for, for certain food, you got to be able to benefit once being um, juice. Yeah, to show you part of the system. Yeah, because this is what they're doing eventually. Anyway, speculation also plays a part in food prices fluctuation. The report added, it stated that the market speculation on expected demands and on the potential impact of weather and environmental condition on, project, on projected production can drive up or decrease prices. The COVID 19 uh, pandemic have further instructed signific significant cost increase in well, freight and logistic freight 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 yeah freight which is um yeah um, shipping freight freight yeah and logistics for example maize and wheat prices were 44.1 and toward 1.3 percent higher than their respective 2020 averages mostly on a strong demand and tighter supplies especially among major wheat export 
So guess who, gets in, guess who gets in richer with the same increase? The people that control the market, that have the monopoly the market. Mm -hmm. You know? Read, read this micro in the meantime. Huh? Here we come now. Gone. This is Micah 6 and verse 9. Said the Lord Yahweh, voice crieth unto the city. And, and this is what we do when we preach it, when we preach in the streets, you know, weather. And the men of wisdom shall see thy name. Mm -hmm. Hear you the rod and who had appointed it. So the men of wisdom shall see thy name, thy reputation, and the name Yahweh, the Heavenly Father's name, and, and Yahweh Shai, his son's name, weather. And who had appointed it, right? So only Moses I appointed it, right? Verse 10. And there are there yet treasures of wickedness in the house of the wicked mm -hmm. and the scant and the scant measure that is abominable good the scant mean that it's scanty it's scarce all right it's scarce brother god verse 11 shall i come them pure with the wicked with, with, the, with wicked the wicked balance and with the bag of deceitful weight for the rich men thereof are full of violence. Now, when, when it's full of violence, these men setting up the people for fight against each other. You know? Where that? And the inhabitants thereof have spoken lies, and their tongue is deceitful in their mouth. Mm -hmm. Therefore, also I will make. Yeah, on the note there, right? People like. Um, uh, what the guy name was on the radio? Gar Mosley to Adam. A guy was saying that Gar Mosley ain't addressing this thing. And even if he did, he'd do it vaguely. He ain't really, you know, giving people answers as he's supposed to be doing. You know, he's just talking about the increase of the, the cases and whatnot and so forth and other, other information to keep people well, in check. But he went he vaguely. A guy was saying that, yo, when, when this thing really hit, everybody became the old doctors and so forth. And some people saying that grow your own but growing your own is a tedious thing you gotta wait till it grow and then you gotta sell it or you gotta barter or whatever and you gotta prepare for all sorts of things when it comes to growing your own produce and then as my shark mentioned um, a couple weeks back these people can check you on our regulations farming regulations if you're using the, rest, the right pesticides and the right fertilizer for what for making food worse for making produce worse Therefore also I will make thee sick in smiting thee, mm -hmm. in in making thee desolate because of thy sins. And this is what the most I doing right now. You're making people sick and with and with a, a so-called virus that is not even that serious. You know? Because they themselves say it's a 99.9% recovery the recovery rate they themselves said that that it could it could be resolved but they 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 were well, they how you could put it i want to inflate him but they um demonizing the the numbers or the 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 detrimentalness or the or the severity of this of this virus you know what I'm uh, they might flag with you on double. but let me see what the Lord do, eh? Where that? God, 14. Thou shalt eat but not be satisfied. Mm -hmm. And thy, thy casting down shall be in the midst of thee. Yeah, because people crying out, oh, when last I had a piece of chicken, remember the early stages? When last I had a piece of churches and things. When last I had this, when last I had that. And then when they're when the going to buy the stuff, they're buying a set of junk. And they build building the immune system to stay within the same lifestyle. And then when they get sick, the same by how I get sick. How they get sick? Because the iniquity. The sin is called sickness. Brother? Can. And thou shalt take hold, but shall not deliver. Mm -hmm. And that which thou delivereth will I give up to the sword. Thou shall sow, but thou so somebody can try to save somebody, but the most I can deliver them up to the sword. Mm -hmm. Where that? Thou shall sow, but thou shall not reap. Mm -hmm. Thou shall treat the olives, but thou shall not anoint thee with oil mm -hmm. and seed wine, but shall not drink wine. 
Yeah, so this is this is the most I judgment going out throughout the earth and things are going to get worse. Worse. You know? There are gonna be a lot of homeless people and so forth. And then this when Isa gonna say, yeah, we got them now. They can beg for the chip now. Brother? God. Yeah, it says for a country such as Guyana, the situation of of the global food commodities will have mixed imp yeah. will have mixed import in impact as an export exporter Diana is affect affected by global pricing it will receive for our export of rice and sugar it will welcome it, it is welcome news that rice production is progressing well in the cereal pr price index, rice regis registered a slight decline, 4% in price in 2021. Compared to 2020 the levels, but importantly, it continued to be higher than previous Crown 19 levels. In this case, the small prices decline is reported to be a result of um, um, a result of ample global supplies and increased competition among suppliers. There's always been competition. There will always be competition. All right. So they're just basically saying the basic stuff, but they get into the root, the root source of why all this happening. You hear that? And it says, for its part, Ghana continues to have stable markets for its rice and remains the, um, the number one rice producing country in the Carib CARICOM. Yeah. As with other countries, Guyana is also feeling the impact of higher prices for imported food, processed and raw materials, feedstocks and, and farming input, input supplies, yeah, because food poison. Because countries are Shan. Oh, it's a tablet. Yeah, because um those saying. Yeah, so basically Guyana and these other countries they with a competition. Mm. Yo, yeah, they'll come with supplies, right? So, um, when, when, when a country is solely dependent on imports and so forth, and this we talk about in, um, in Revelation 18, that the earth enjoyed the delicacies because of all the imports and exports of the so-called United States. And this was, this was President Trump at the time was trying to do. He was trying to you know, strengthen their import and export with the tar tariff wars and whatnot. But she's gonna, but America's gonna lose her strength, and a lot of people's gonna mourn. As he's saying, the whole world is is suffering because of the the, the food prices um, rising. Right up, God. Real car cost, cost of living. Yeah, except for 2021 as a whole, the FAO cereal prices in in index increased by just over 27 percent for 2020 and the index stands as the highest annual average registered since 2012 both wheat and corn significant components imported for food um, manufacture in guyana are included here for 2022 we can likely expect that the global and the national food system will continue to grapple with conditions um, that that will impact food prices. The so report states the word grapple, you know the word means wrestle. In continue the prices will continue to wrestle. And people gonna get frustrated and people gonna do crazy shit in this place, bro. You will close off on the last paragraph there. Yeah. That last minute. Yeah, it says in addition, the seasonal uh, fluctuation in, produ in productions and demand 
it is expected that the backlog and interruptions in global shipping and you, logistics you see the backlog as I was mentioned in Florida in Florida um, Florida ports there was a lot of backlogs because of the so-called protocols the set up and this is exactly what they want they want the produce to spoil they want people business to, to plummet because of these backlogs so that they would be solely dependent on the system whether it says uncertain labor availability the pandemic and impact of climate and weather events will all continue to have their effect on food prices it says it, according to the report guyana's food system will have to continue providing safe healthy affordable affordable food for all as well as the providing as to provide safe, safe according to boost standards healthy according to boost standards because you put in msg and all sort of thing in these foods monosodium glutamate that's put holes in your brain you put in um aspartame which is 2000 times sweeter than sugar and increases the chance of getting cancer what's some of them other things you put in my shop oh put in um beaver bomb the juice the pork and all these things inside the food. Okay, it says it is more yeah it says um, to, pro, to provide livelihood opportunities for our farm um, farming communities it is more critical that than ever to follow the comprehensive path to national food system transformation that Guyana outlines at the U UN Food System Summit, social protection for the most. It says UN Food System Summit, right? The mm -hmm. System Summit. How, how system mean? A pit. Can, it says social protection for the most vulnerable, continuous improvement in production and food distribution, efficiency to keep prices competitive, embracing and diversification of agriculture with technology with technology, with technology and digital innovation in other words like, yeah, what they're doing also is that they're using nanotechnology and adding it to the, the um, foods now too mm -hmm. so the nanotechnology is controlling basically the food they're killing all certain what should say essential, essential vitamins in the body so they're gonna make you sick for, for so they could apply the um and solely dependent vaccine. on the product. Yeah, we should go back to the medical supply and these things. You know yeah, that's why it says the embracing diversification mm -hmm. of agriculture with technology and See? digital innovation. Right. Streamlining the corrupt the current and emerging value chains, Porching, um, pursuing trade with shorter supplies chains and ready and reduce Make hey the script the script yeah, yeah. the, the um, we can need the file bread mm -hmm. and he saw a couple of years ago we was watching how the taste changing feces into meat right and feces into water and certain things they was trying to do reverse using technology yeah, yeah. and when it says um, streaming streamlining the current emerging value chains right and Pursuing trade with shorter supply chains, they want to cut out the middle man, okay. they want to cut out certain small man. So, it, so it will be one one food conglomerate that you have to put yeah. for food, for med medication, for everything, and no way else. That's why they set up stuff like medical misinformation and stuff like that. Okay. You know, so if you could get free free um um independent news, why you can't get independent um um means a healing you know you got that okay it's a, and reducing the risk in agriculture there are few short term solutions that will be sustainable the answers lie in the longer hill or hall the report noted so in 
they set on the long haul because what was, was the long haul they're trying to set up their kingdom as we, we, we've been saying throughout they're trying to set up their kingdom whereby you solely be dependent on their system and the short the short term is systems for what usher into their long haul system right any other statements or precepts so basically them people don't plot the scripture says one to the inhabitants of the world right for the devil that come down upon you with great wrath because these people making it seems like if they trying the best at the same time they all planning this right and they're using certain big words to show off the public exactly right that hey you check you checking the meaning of it and so on these people blatantly telling you that hey we poisoning y'all and the information that we giving y'all right is only the small is only um is is only on the chart of a small concern of the bigger things we did um discuss right because these are small things right this is all going to war because it involves food and and and, and nation in turn in civil right internal corruption and so on anyway Right away that we want to give our praises to Yahweh, Bashem, Yahweh Shai, Bashem Rakakodash. You know, double honors to the elders and the apostles of GMS. Salutations to you, brothers, who's pushing this truth. You know, stay woke, hey, for we, um, this is not the place where we rest. Yeah. Right? Salvation is nearer than when we believe. We soon out to you know, you know, keep pushing, you sisters, keep, you know, um, pushing by your husbands and watch over them children. Watch over them children. Right. You know? Hey, just shallow one bracata, a bad babal, 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 shallow one.